G'day guys, I thought today we'd be doing a review of the Cold Steel Axe Trainer, that is this one right here. So guys, I ordered one of these about four days ago and it arrived in the post yesterday. Fantastic. Here was me thinking I'd be waiting ages for it. I've been wanting one of these for a while now because I want to do some axe training. I want to be able to do some training about disarming an opponent and fighting and sparring with some of my partners to see what it was more like to actually fight with an axe. Not everyone got to fight with a sword. Swords were probably pretty rare in the early medieval period. And that is really up to the, about the time of um, the Battle of Hastings. So, this particular item is 410 grams, which is incredibly realistic. And it's 50 centimeters long, which again is a perfect sort of size, I think, for a small kind of hatchet axe, which you typically see being used by, I guess, um, medieval warriors and just general medieval people. What I really like about this is it's an incredibly blunt edge around about one centimeter. Let's take a look. So you should be able to see it right about there. Really nice flat edge. Now the axe shape itself is not really quite the same as you would find on a typical medieval battle axe. So you do lose a little bit there, but that's not what this is designed for. This axe, in fact, is designed as a trainer for their uh, modern military type axes, which tend to get distributed amongst sort of special forces and special operations guys who might go into an urban environment and have to break down doors and that kind of thing. And you have this as a very uh, interesting weapon to use. My days in the military are long gone, and I love my medieval reenactment. However, um, now the, the obvious thing here which is, is wrong, I guess, for early med medieval combat is this um, hook on the back of it, but I, that's okay, that's not what this was designed for. This is, as I say, designed as a trainer for, mo uh, for modern military axes. But I like this so much, this is just, um, probably the most realistic way to be able to incorporate an axe into fight training. I've seen some people try and use LARP axes, that is those foam ones, and they just don't last. Uh, whereas against something like a cold steel sword, this would be absolutely perfect. Righto guys, so considering the cost was about $40 Australian delivered, You've got an incredibly lightweight item made out of polypropylene and you have a, um, a nice length which is just really easy to use. I'm giving this 10 out of 10. Absolutely no hesitation there whatsoever. I thoroughly recommend this. I think this is a fantastic piece of kit and if you're into medieval combat training this is a really good axe to consider. One other little point we'll uh, incorporate here is I've seen some debate online. I've been seeing some debate online recently about how to carry these. And I know there are some people out there who've made these incredibly complicated Kydex sheaths for them and so on. Um, not my kind of thing because, again, I'm not in the military anymore and I just don't need that kind of thing. But um, something as simple as this, this is just an axe ring and it's perfect for this. Now I can carry this round, it's nice and available, easily to use, and easy to put away. There we go, it's out. 
and find it. There we go, and it's away. There you go. So really, really easy to use. Um, very simple, very cheap. Just a couple of hours in the workshop, it's all done. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe and share. I'll catch you in my next video.